Miles Sanders, and they're back with it a touchdown at 21-14. Now after the touchdown, ready to kick it away is Sanders. Take it in at the three. And they will be backed up deep. Trouble here as they're going to start this drive at the six. The Texans offense ready to go here for their next drive. And the points, they have come fast and furious in this quarter. You really don't want to be on the defensive side of the ball right now, do you? Because you're either thinking... My replacement may get an opportunity. <laughs> Your head better be on a swivel. Totally. Or maybe I just need to get out of the game for a while because I just can't slow these guys down. They've got to figure out a way to disrupt these offenses. And typically, one guy makes a big play, and that can help change things. And they'll be looking for disruption on both sides right now. Touchdown! Chris Olave, 78 yards. That's a pretty quick response to that last touchdown drive, and it seemed like they had maybe given up momentum, but not so fast. No, not at all, because they end up pushing the lead up once again, and you're exactly right. Thought momentum might have been shifting. Instead, they grabbed old Mo, didn't let him get to the opposite sideline. Now after the touchdown, ready to kick it away is Sanders. From a yard or two deep, here comes a return. And he's up across the 25 and down at the 28. Out there, set and ready for this next drive, the Washington offense. Charles, this offense, they've been on a roll. Two drives ago, they scored. Remember, last drive was that one play touchdown strike, so now they're looking to make it three for three. You know, I talked to a Hall of Famer one time about, hey, when you're on defense and these types of things are happening to you, what goes through your mind? And he told me at that point, it's not about schemes. It's not about what's called from the sideline. It's about players. Who's going to make a play, make a stand, and stop this offense from doing what they've been doing? Under pressure, down he goes. Sacked at the 10. And Washington now going to use the first of their three timeouts as they'll stop it with a little over 30 seconds to go in the first half of play. Second down and goal. Mahomes. And he's got his man in stride, complete. Touchdown, Washington. Jahan Dotson from 10 yards out. And the Commanders get a late score here, the final minute of the first half. Extra point up and good by Sanders. And they're within seven now at 28-21. Now after the touchdown, ready to kick it away is Sanders. From just inside the 20, a short kick. And a nice return sets him up pretty good here right at the 30-yard line. The Texans offense ready to go here for their next drive. And with a seven-point lead, they'll likely look to take this to the locker room and not really press the issue. And he's going to lose yards. They take him down at the 26. Now the Texans will burn the first of their timeouts as they stop it with 19 seconds to go in half number one. Alert! To throw again on second down. Allen, complete to Alave on the out route. Now another timeout called for by the offense. So that means they're down to one remaining here as we head toward halftime. Six DBs on the field for Washington on third down. So the shotgun snap to Allen. Rolling to, and he can't find a receiver, and he's brought down. And they're going to take a timeout defensively. So with fourth down coming up, they go ahead and burn it and say, we'll see what happens. So this has been a lot like a tennis match, hasn't it? Back and forth. Both of these offenses have their way so far. So maybe the question isn't who's going to score the most points in this game. Maybe it's who's going to get some stops. Yeah, absolutely. And that sack, finally a first step in the right direction for a stop.
And now the punt team couldn't get ready in time, and this is going to be a delay. So they accept the penalty, of course, and push the offense backwards a bit. And they'll send the slot in motion left. Allen will look to throw for it on fourth. He rifles one that's intercepted. Kyler Gordon picks it off. Well, that's a drive killer right there. Not a really confident throw either. This one was kind of up for grabs, and it's going to come down the hands of the wrong team. Yellow, yellow. And they line up now for what will likely be the last play of the first half. Final shot before the half from Mahomes. He's going to take a shot at the end zone. Why not? And incomplete on the deep ball. First half in the books. You're watching the NFL on EA Sports. And we welcome you back now alongside Charles Davis. I'm Brandon Gunn getting set for quarter number three here. Both these offenses have been in fine form. What will the second half bring us as we are underway in quarter three? Fields it right around the goal line. And they'll start this drive just across the 30. Pretty nice work on the return. Out there set ready for this next drive, the Washington yeah, yeah. offense. This offense, Charles, had a strong first half throwing the football, at least in terms of yardage, but that hasn't translated so far in the score. And that's caught inside the 35. Touchdown, Washington. Joe Mixon, 69 yards. And the Commanders come right out of the locker room and score here in the opening minute of the third quarter. Extra point up and good by Sanders, and we are all tied at 28. So a tie ball game here as the kick's away. This fielded right at the goal line. And it's a pretty good return here as he'll get this up to the 29. They begin with a run by Mixon. And he'll scratch out a yard up to the 30, and that's all. Well, it's hard to have vision as a runner and find a hole when there's nothing but defenders in your way. They stacked that one up really well. But give him credit. Instead of trying to bounce it out and turn it into a big play, which might have turned into a big loss, Kai just took his medicine there and took the one yard. And he's going to have to eat this one as down he goes. Chase Young. In there to get him. It's a loss of five. Well, he was really focused downfield, but there was really no viable options. The coverage was too good. And the defense really quick in the tempo of that play with their pass rush because there was nowhere for him to go with the play. And Allen going to be intercepted for the third time. Picked up by Divine Diablo. And he will bring this one back. It is a pick six for a Washington touchdown. Sanders now to add the extra point. It's up and good, and they've jumped back ahead, 35-28. So they throw the pick six. They'll get another shot at it now as this one's in the air. Taking it about the one. And able to get this across the 20, but not much further as he's dropped it to 23-yard line. The Texans offense ready to go here for their next drive. They're sort of seeing themselves spiral out of control. Let's see if they can get things back on track. And this is where the coach is walking that line of being calm and really every being firm with his team. Add one, tell me one, see that we're having a tough patch. This too shall pass, this too shall pass. And if I we kept having a rough patch, he said, but you've got to do something <laughs> to make it pass. And that's what they have to do. They've got to get some control back, get themselves reasserted, and calm things down. See if they can get calm and reassert themselves here. Middle, 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 middle. 
Now Allen. And that's going to be incomplete. The contact there enough to jar that ball free. And it brings up fourth down. So they're going for it, and here's Allen. And he's brought down. Can't do anything with a football. It's a sack and a turnover on downs. Boy, a real head scratcher there. And now, boy, the ball's going to go over on downs here inside the 10-yard line. Well, this is a nice little gift wrap situation as they take over first and goal. Joe Mixon, a seven-yard touchdown grab. And the Commanders get another third-quarter touchdown to add on to that lead. Extra point up and good by Sanders. And the lead now up to 14. Now after the touchdown, ready to kick it away is Sanders. Very short kick taken right at the 20. And a nice return sets him up pretty good here right at the 30-yard line. So first and 10 now from the 30. commence with a run by Mixon and forget that 100 yard rushing game at least for the moment as he'll lose yardage here and fall back under the century mark for the game Chris Jones that time coming in with a tackle behind the line back to Mixon on second down he'll get a yard that's all as they get him down at the 28 not the start to the drive they were looking for. That run doesn't do much at all. No, not at all. And it leaves them a third and long. And you know, this is the time of game where these drives really, really start to matter. They've got to make some moves. Allen. Quick slant caught by Chase. And he stopped up short of the first as they tackle him down at about the 36. 56, 56. Alert, alert, alert. They do go for it. Here's Allen. Finding his target, it's Trey McBride. And he is going to have a Texans first down as they manage to convert. And that'll keep the drive alive. So a moment to catch our collective breath after the fourth down conversion. We'll return with more after this. This is the NFL, and it's on EA Sports. So signs of life in what's been a dormant offense in this second half. Here's first and ten. Mix it up the middle. And he can only manage to get a couple. Second and eight coming up. And that last carry puts him right at 100 yards for the game. So how has he done it? Because he's been patient. Followed his blocks, let everything develop, and then burst through for big gains. Back to Mixon on second down. And this play will be blown up. He'll lose yardage back at the 38. That'll go as a loss of nine, and it leads to third down. You know when I could tell this was going to end really badly? When he launched himself behind the line and made a beeline for the ball carry. You get one of those tactical machines in the middle on your trail, things are normally ending pretty quickly. Now throwing on third down there, but he cannot connect. We've seen this quite a few times in this game. Offensive line unable to keep leverage, unable to keep people away, facing a lot of pressure. Fortunate, fortunate just to get rid of it. One of the reasons they're down is that inability, though, to stop the pressure. We saw another example of it there. And he's brought down. Can't do anything. 